the main focus of the prayer move is what? Ensure increase in public spending, which we are all aware of the nomenclature of the current, that is the 10% of the two declaration, that many countries are yet to attend that uh, 10% of their total annual budget to, national, uh, to agriculture. Is enhance the resilience of livelihood and production system to climate variability and other related risks. We all know climate change is around the corner and there is need for concerted effort. We are, we are having this dialogue to reflect as a country in terms of um, the progress we have made in terms of the agriculture sector, looking at the CADI resort framework and the gaps and what we need to do going forward in terms of looking at the recommendations coming from the report to improve our food and nutrition security going forward. As a country, we have not been putting um, the right investments in the agriculture sector. We are not meeting the 10% uh, Maputo Malabo declaration in terms of um, budgetary allocation, both across states and at the federal level. The right investments need to be put in the agriculture sector in key areas, and those key areas are areas like extension services, youth in agriculture, women in agriculture, um, reducing post-harvest losses, meaning that we need to focus on um, supporting farmers to have storage and processing facilities. We need money to latch our production and the implement, implementation of uh, lack of to release the fund of budget in time is affecting us. Agri is a seasonal something. We farm our, we start our planting. If rain come early, it will be like uh, April, April, May. Then if you want a farmer to harvest or to get something, you have to plan for the farmer in time. Releases in agriculture, in agricultural sector, like budget releases, is very poor. They, uh, we got fertilizer just a month ago when the planting season is over. So I don't know how farmers are able to use that to perform magic. And we're saying there is no food, there is inflation in the country and all of that. So government really needs to be serious. And not only government this time around, we're also calling on other partners to make sure that um, they take uh, investment in agriculture seriously.